everyone, welcome back. So today I am filming a sort of different video for my channel. I don't tend to do these every month, but it's an August favourites slash August recap. So a lot has happened in August. Obviously it's been the summer holidays and I haven't been in college, so I've got to do a lot more than I normally would do. August is probably one of my favourite months just because you don't have to go into school or college. Um, means everyone gets to do a lot of more things like with my family and my friends um the weather has been okay this year like it's been a bit on and off like some days it'd be raining some days it'd be really sunny but um yeah overall it's been quite a good summer i've done quite a lot and basically i just wanted to make a video and store everything that i've done in this one video quite a lot of the things i mentioned will probably be in a vlog as well somewhere on my channel so you can head over and watch them as well if you would like um so one of the first things that I did in August was Summer in the City. This feels like so long ago now, but it really wasn't that long ago. Um, I went to London on my own pretty much and met up with a load of friends for Summer in the City this year. As you probably know, if you haven't seen the vlogs, they will all be linked down below. I don't want to go into it too much because I've already spoke about Summer in the City in general, so um, I'm going to leave it at that. Definitely something I'll be doing next year. It's always in August brings everyone together, it's just a great convention in general. I've also got to spend quite a long time with my sister this August as she's been off of work for a few weeks and we got to just like hang out and see each other a bit more. Um, we went to London for the day for my college enrolment and we also went to the PB Sug Life shop because that was open the day we went so we thought we'd pop along to that and yeah, it was really nice to spend time together. We drove up, which was quite stressful, but we did it, it was fine. Like, and now I know that it is sort of possible if I needed to drive to this college, I could. I probably won't, just because I'm not the most confident driver and London is very scary at the like non-busiest times. So I also met Joe Sugg at the shop. Um, I'll insert a picture now. It was really nice meeting him. Um, my sister was really pleased that we got to meet someone because she'd driven all the way up. Basically she wanted to go to the shop and that's why she came with me to my enrolment, otherwise I was just going to get the train on my own. Um, but it was really nice. Uh, she was a bit sad we didn't get to see Alfie and Zoe but I didn't mind too much. I've met them before and I know it's probably really hectic, really busy day and we were really lucky to meet Joe anyway. And I got a signed tote bag. So when we were in there, me and my sister picked up these signed tote bags. I framed mine and put like the little receipt in there because it says the creator store and I thought that was quite cool. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put this yet, at the moment it's just lent up on my unit. But um, because I will be moving in with my dad, which is another thing that I wanted to mention, um, part time I will be living with my dad now as he lives nearer to London so I'll be commuting from his and... Basically, I need to redo my room up at his house because I designed that room when I was probably like 13, 14? I don't know, it was quite a while ago. I can't remember when he moved in. Basically, there's like One Direction fetus posters, there's Tinkerbell stickers. It needs redoing. So I'll probably show you in a vlog at some point, you'll see it, but... um. Maybe I'll do a room tour when I've done it up properly. It's like an oak wood, I think it's oak anyway, wooden and like outdoory vibe. So I want to bring in some like rose gold features and try and make it a bit more me. Um, <laughs> I do really like it though. It is nice. It's put together well, um, but it's not the style I want to go for anymore. So <laughs> I wanted to get a few bits for dad's house to make it a bit more of me and I found this canvas, canvas, I don't really know what you'd call it, wall art is what I'd call it, in Matalan in Portsmouth. Um, so this is, this is it, I'm going to have to show you because it's not really going to fit in the screen. Um, the lighting's not great. Is that better? Can you see it? It's like this wooden, this wood is the wood that I have at dad's house, so like my bed's made out of this, my bedside table. Um, basically this just has like loads of strings that are like elasticated and it had these three little um, memo notes on it and I've just added some pictures and some Polaroids and this is going to hang up at my dad's house. These bits come off by the way, these corner bits, it's just because I've got to transport it there still. Um, 
Sorry if that came out really dark. I don't really know what's happening. It's not very bright in my room today, so hopefully you could see that. Um, I really like that. I also used the little pegs on it, the gold ones, are what I got from Wilkinson's. I can change all the um, photos around on it and yeah, it's going to be something that when I'm at his I can look at it and be reminded of home and my friends. Okay, so moving on to like my favourites of the month. Um, every month I get my photos printed out through an app called Free Prints. Um, it's like 3 99 and you get 45 pictures to print out so it's quite good. Um, I generally do that every month and I print them out and put them in photo albums. Um, I have about three or four of these now. This is my most recent one. It's this month. Right, let's skip to this month. Okay, so there's like some ones from Bournemouth, even though that wasn't this month. Um, Summer in the City. Oh gosh. Lots from Summer in the City. I don't know if you can really see. Um, oh no. Can you see? That's me and Joe. So I also went to Brighton for Sam's um, meetup and that was really nice to see everyone. Also there was a vlog on that so I'll link that down below. Don't really have much else to say about that. Um, that's pretty much it. I definitely want to go back because I feel like every time I go and I go back I find like a different section of the lanes or Brighton that I haven't seen before and it's just really cute, really easy to document so definitely will be going back there soon. I suppose Another part of my August was I got my results from college and I, as you may or may not know, I did a level three BTEC in fashion and clothing and I came out with D star, D star, D, which is like distinctions. Um, if you know what that means, you know what that means. Basically, I did a lot better than I thought I'd done. Um, I thought, well, I was told I couldn't get that, but I did, so don't know what happened there. Um, <laughs> I'm really pleased with my results anyway and I got into the college I wanted to go to. August was also the month I found out that Becca was going to go to Bournemouth. She was umming and ahhing about going and now she is set on going, she's got halls there. If you watch her vlogging channel and everything you'll know a lot more about this but she's moving to Bournemouth and I will still be here slash London so we're not going to be too far apart which is great. Um, and I'm sure there will be lots of vlogs of me taking a trip to Bournemouth to see her. Um, so yeah, that should all be good fun. Okay, so my last favourite, I only just got, so it only just was in the end of August, is a record player. I've been wanting one of these for quite a while, but they are really expensive, so I was like, I had to think twice before getting one. Um, I got this one, it's called, can you see, In Tempo, and this was from b&m and it was only 39 pounds which is really good for a record player i'm hoping it's going to be good quality i haven't tested an actual record on it yet because i don't have any um i definitely want to get harry Styles' album on record just because i think that would just sound amazing like it's such a raw album it will sound great and um, the only thing i have tested is that it's got a bluetooth speaker so you can play your music on your phone through it which is really handy because um, you can still play your own music through it and the speakers are really good so would highly recommend if you were looking for one really cheap and good i'll have to get back to you on how good it is with actual records <laughs> that is everything for my august favorites i hope you did enjoy this video it was a bit random i sort of just decided i'm just gonna have a chat about august in general so i hope you did enjoy if you did please leave a like subscribe if you are new and i will see you next time Bye.